Welcome back to Let's Play Heroes Chronicles. I am your host, Board Gamer Girl, and we are in the first law scenario of the Rule of Beastmasters campaign. And Jerwolf lived, which is super awesome and exciting. Really, Basilisks, you didn't want to join me? There's like a bazillion of you. Alright, Jerwolf, you're gonna continue to run away and hopefully pick up some troops. <clears throat> that you're less useless. Um. Yeah, I'll take plus two attack skill. I've got the upgrade Strip on Fly Hive, because, let's be honest, that <clears throat> is a really useful, I mean, upgrade. They're just ridiculously awesome. One spell power. Hello, other town. Hello, fancy mage guild. Do I have upgraded wisdom? I do. Well, let's see what I get. Nice. Pretty solid. Yeah, we'll fight the monks. Oh, 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 there's a crap ton of them. Awesome. Yeah. All right. They're gonna kill the bejesus out of me. At least they're squishy. Well, they're relatively squishy. Haste is just not going to get you there fast enough. Kill them, please. Thank you. Kill them. Oh, we get this awesome. Oh, I have to. I have to... Can't go anywhere. All right. We're gonna start by picking up some knolls. As we pick you up an army, go back. You'll sit here for the moment and just. Try to defend the realm, get a few more spells and whatnot. Bad news, sir, the scout said. Arathian troops were seen marching towards both of Baron Paglon's towns. The king's troops, I asked? They were flying the king's banner, yes, and one of the columns had a wagon of resources as well. That's just great. If Arathia garnered all her forces against me now, this rebellion was over before it had a chance to get started. I had been counting on the arrogance of the nobility to discount my actions either as unimportant or not worth their attention. Perhaps if I hadn't killed Lord Onsten, they wouldn't see me as a threat. If we were just escaping slaves, they might ignore us. Now we're rebels and murderers. What do you have?
And it might make more sense to upgrade the, the basilisks, but we're going to just do it this way for the moment. Because I don't really see what else will be super effective. And... We already got the nulls from here, yes? Yes, alright. So we'll just come out here. I mean, there's just nothing to give you here, so, um... Come over here for the moment. Turnum, what are the chances? Well, actually, actually, I could probably do it this way. Never mind. We'll try and see if we can cut off the guy. Alright. Pretty sure you got taken, but... Oh no. Well, okay, well let's come on down here and get that guy. Make him rue the day. Then he decided to mess with us. Oh gosh, there's a crap ton of them. Of course! Well, come on. Alright, let's have me run up here like I initially intended. I might have you run over here. Assuming you don't head in a way that will get you killed. Um, yeah, you'll pick up some gnolls. And then you'll also head uh, towards these stat upgrades. I mean, they might have one more town back there, but it... It's looking possibly unlikely. In fact, it's looking so unlikely that I should probably just, well, whatever, we'll just, we'll take it one more time. Hang out there. And core back up over here. God, you're slow, dude. There is something to be said for these mudlanders. Once they get an idea in their heads, they really carry through with it. Relic and his assistant showed me their list of laws last night. They had written them on the back of sheets of bark stripped carefully from the stubby swamp trees. It took hours to read through them all. There was a law for everything. They began, as I suggested, with a law against slavery, and from there moved through murder, theft, and other crimes. Then they made laws for governing their work habits, eating habits, and even how much they sleep is too much. And even how much sleep is too much. I asked for it. Now, what was I going to do with this monstrosity?
Woohoo, we learned slow. We'll get ourselves some knowledge. And then before we kill Adela, we'll get you some plus one spell power. And we'll get you some plus one spell power. And then. Yeah. Whatever. I think we'll be fine. Why do I think we'll be fine? Because I'm awesome. Okay. The good news is that even though your spell power is ridiculous, uh, you don't have that many spell points, so that's solid. I should totally pay attention to the fact that those people are there. That would have been helpful. Totally dead. Goodbye. I'll take expert logistics. Red has been vanquished. Congratulations, our enemies have been defeated. Victory is yours. Awesome. Well, this is going to be a really short episode, but we're just gonna have to to deal with that today. Um. So thanks everyone for watching. This is Board Gamer Girl saying have a great day. See ya.